You gotta stop watching the numbers. When you're creating content, don't worry about how many people are viewing it. Worry about how much better you are getting yourself so you can actually get to the point that you have become a professional and you have done it, but you have to do this consistently. When my father was creating content, when he started, he was 60 years old. He felt like an old, crazy man talking to himself for the first year and a half. I can tell you something. It's not an overnight thing. It does not happen overnight. I've been doing this for seven years. The first year, you know, it's like I didn't have the certainty that I have right now. I didn't have like confidence in my ability to create an impact. That first year, it's about you. It's about your own ability and your own self-confidence. Without attention, I can't win the game of life. I need attention. And attention is the path of any good marketing strategy. How do we get more attention? If we don't have people looking at our products, if we don't have people looking at our services, if we don't have people looking at us, we can't flourish and prosper. I have a company called AGM Marketing, Attention Grabbing Media. The company is a big company now. 120 employees, we service a lot of celebrities and superstars, a lot of great brands, e-commerce brands and so on. And uh, we're really good at what we do. My name is more famous than the company name. I am the one that brings attention to the business, not the other way around. Same thing with my father. My father's name is more famous than the company name. We have a company called Natural Slim. Natural Slim is our brand. Our company is Natural Slim, but the one that brings the attention to our company is Frank Suarez. He passed away three years ago, but Frank Suarez still today reaches 200 million accounts a month. Last year, 2023, we reached 2.4 billion accounts. We have 32 and a half million followers. We have the largest social media following on the planet in Latin America. This happened in the last three years after he's gone. Talk about building a legacy, but Frank Suarez is the one that builds. And I'm talking about if you got anybody's looking around for his name, we have three separate brands. One of them is called Frank Suarez. The other one is called Metabolismo TV. And the other one is called Natural Slim. And when you add them all up, and when you add Facebook and Instagram and TikTok and YouTube and so on, we have 32 and a half million followers across all platforms. But the brand, is Natural Slim. The personal brand is Frank Suarez. So we created this ecosystem. It's all together. It's all connected. It's all part of one. I don't have a separation. Oh, this is my personal page and this is my family name. And this is like, no, it's all, I have a purpose to impact hundreds of millions of people and hundreds of millions of businesses. And in order for me to do that, I gotta understand that this social media game is my path to be able to accomplish that because there's people out there looking for solutions every day. If I want to connect with my friends and family, I call them and I text them and I take them out to dinner. Social media, is that's not my purpose. Social media is a path for us to share value with each other. You know how many lives we've made better because of social media? You know how many businesses were saved? Think about COVID pandemic, 2021. If you don't have social media, the economy today will be at a very different, lower condition. Social media, I can tell you, kept my businesses alive and growing, just like it did for many other millions of businesses. Start creating valuable content to share your knowledge and message with the world. What is your ability to impact and influence the life of somebody else? That focus of helping others is what you wanna do here. Focus on helping others with your content. You don't wanna just give away your products and services, but you wanna give away your information, your value. And that's how you win. When my father was creating content, when he started, he was 60 years old. He felt like an old, crazy man talking to himself for the first year and a half. I can tell you something. It's not an overnight thing. It does not happen overnight. I've been doing this for seven years. The first year, you know, it's like, I didn't have the certainty that I have right now. I didn't have like confidence in my ability to create an impact. That first year, it's about you. It's about your own ability and your own self-confidence. You gotta stop watching the numbers. When you're creating content, don't worry about how many people are viewing it. Worry about how much better you are getting yourself so you can actually get to the point that you have become a professional and you have done it. But you have to do this consistently. If you do this for two or three months and then you call me and you say, ah, oh, Manuel, I'm, I'm only getting two views on my video and one like and nobody cares about it. You know, I'm just gonna go and give up and I don't know. Well, if you do that, then you're missing out on the real opportunity here. There's no such thing as failure.
There really isn't. You gotta just keep going. In that first year or two, you gotta know that it's mostly about yourself and your own ability to create content, communicate, and get that message out there. And you do it consistently, nonstop.